Hey there. Yes? Huh? Messages yes. Be available yeah? Yeah. Huh? Hi, yeah. how are you? Report yeah. to the cafeteria. Huh? One of your brawlmen has gotten stuck huh? again. Yeah? Yeah? Oh, thank goodness you're here. It's been non-stop since you left. Want to fill me in on what's happening? Ever since we found out the gunners are coming back, we've been doing everything we can to prepare for them. We've got patrols watching the roads, lookouts stationed at settlements, and every department head's been working their ass off to get the HQ ready. Hell, even Mansfield's been getting his hands dirty. We caught him crawling through the air ducts, looking for structural weaknesses. Where is everyone else? Right now, Therese is out checking on some reports we keep getting in. Something about strange sightings off of the coast. Lupe is trying to clear up some interference we keep getting on the comm array. Cassandra, as far as I know, is stockpiling medical supplies. And Mansfield is nursing a twisted ankle, a result of his air duct adventures. You can't be serious. According to Mansfield, shimmying through air ducts is a time-honored Vault 81 practice. Not too sure how I feel about him doing it here, though. So, what's the issue? Well, you see, thanks to Mansfield's impromptu spelunkin, he managed to uncover... Well, how do I put this? Uncover? He slipped and fell through an air vent. Well, yeah, but that's not the important part. The important part is where he fell. What did you find? Mansfield found himself in a sealed-off section of the plaza behind an old bricked-up passageway. The very one you are standing in front of now, as a matter of fact. Took a few hours of him banging and yelling, but eventually someone heard him, and a couple of sledgehammer swings later, we had him free. How's he doing? Well, he hurt his leg, but seemed more concerned about falling behind with his work. A few days off his feet, a couple of stim packs, he'll be fine. So, what's the issue? Well, you see, while he was trapped back there, Mansfield said he heard strange noises. Now, I figured he just got spooked by some leaky pipes or frayed power cables, so I sent down a couple of engineers to check it out. Only, they never came back. When Jake's engineers went missing, I sent down a security team. We lost contact with them, too. In retrospect, maybe there was a good reason that passageway was sealed. I'm gonna go down there, find out what happened to those men. But I need someone I know can handle themselves to back me up. I need you. I have some questions first. Of course. Go ahead, ask.
Why me? You have security. Had security. I already sent a team, and they didn't come back. As good as some of my men are, you're better. That's why I want you on this. Any idea of what I'm going to see in there? Honestly, we've no idea. I'd say the area's been abandoned for a long time, so who knows what's down there? Best you be prepared for anything. Is there anything else I should know? We've already lost at least five people. Might mean the area below is difficult to navigate, maybe even dangerous. Also, it's pitch black down there, so you'll need a flashlight. Hope the one on your pit boy is still working. That's all I needed to know. Right. So you're ready to help find these missing men, or what? All right. I'll find them. Good. I'll head down and wait by the entrance. Don't be long. I hope you can find the missing personnel and bring them back, assuming they're all still... you know. I'll be waiting here. You better head down. Duty facility personnel required. Report to the basement. All right, let's move. What is this place? Why wasn't it on the building blueprints we got from the information broker? The hell was that? those doors? Looks like blast doors. The kind that only opens when they have power. Jake's engineers must have hooked them back up to the energy grid. Huh. No way to pick this. Hmm. Password right. only. I can unlock this door over here. After you. Jake's engineers. How the hell did they even get up there? Let's keep moving. What is it? They're still breathing? They're dead. I'm sorry. Damn it. Should have never sent them down here alone. Maybe Mansfield really did hear something down here. Let's keep moving. Others may still be alive. Gotta find the terminal.
hearing things. You hear that? Eyes open. Weapons at the ready. Jake's engineers. So... You should talk to him. You're the chief! Oh no. Oh, you, you gotta understand. I... I didn't want to. I had no choice. What are you saying? I... I don't, I don't know. Sorry. I think I'm still in shock. It... trapped us. Security tried to help, but... when it attacked... I've never seen anything move that fast. I panicked. I ran. Locked the doors behind me. And now, they're stuck in there with it. What are you doing here? Right. I didn't tell you. I'm sorry. We were meant to be surveying this new section of the plaza. You know, checking for damage and stuff. But... Something started following us. First, we thought it was just our imagination. It's, this this area's been sealed for years. But then... What happened after that? But then... We saw it. We ran. Hid in the large room. But it was already there. Waiting. It just stood there. Staring. We didn't dare move. Seemed like hours, but then the security team came. They shone their lights on it and it went crazy. It sprinted right at us, shrieking. It sunk its teeth into me. And I, I, I ran. I ran and I sealed the doors. I didn't want it to follow me. Oh God. I trapped them in there with it. You have to save them. Please. You saw it? Yeah. It's... It's... Oh, God, I... I don't know what it is. It's... It's skin. The way it moved, it was unnatural. And it's still in there. With the others. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Take this. It's a key card. You'll need it. I grabbed it when I was running. And a bunch of doors slammed shut. You'll... probably need the card to open them again. Oh. It's... It's getting harder to breathe. Huh. He's lost a lot of blood. This will take more than a stim pack to fix. We'll need medical treatment. What do you think we should do? I would think that's obvious. We need to stabilize this guy, or get him to someone else who can. Anything you can do? Me personally, no. But I bet Cassandra can. I'll get this guy out of here. You go on. Try to find the others. I'll return as soon as I can. I can't 
see. Actually, I was looking for you. Keep your voice down. It'll hear you. Noise and sudden movements seem to attract it. That is, if it's still in here. Listen, you've got to get me out of here. What's it? It's... it's... I don't know what. It is, but I'm barely sure it's still in here with me. You've got to get me out! I'll open the door for you. Will you keep your voice down? Even if you could open the door from your side, I'd still be stuck in here. The creature... I... I think it's afraid of light. As long as I stay in the light, I'm safe. But there's nothing but darkness between me and that door. The place you're in. I think it's the control room. There might be controls for lighting in there. If you light my way to the door, I can escape. But don't activate more than two lights at once. Too much light, and the creature goes berserk. We learned that the hard way. Why? What, what happened? When the security team came in here, they had their flashlights on. They pointed them right at the creature and it... It just went crazy! You must have noticed all the smashed light bulbs and chewed up power cables down here. I think the creature did it. Maybe the light scares it, or hurts it. I, I, I don't know. Either way, too much light and it goes nuts. So don't activate any more than two lights at a time, or I'm toast. Don't worry. 
I'll get you out of here. <sighs> Thank you. Activate another light close to me, but be careful. It looks like some of the lights in here are broken. I think I saw a diagram in the control room. Might help you figure things out. If I had to guess, right now I'm under one of the main lights. Please, hurry! It's close enough. I'm moving. <sighs> One step closer to freedom. Turn off the light behind me, then find the next closest. Remember, too many lights at once, I'll be attacked. So, don't do that. Close enough. I'm moving. <sighs> One step closer to freedom. Turn off the light behind me, then find the next closest. Remember, too many lights at once, I'll be attacked. So, don't do that.
I've got it. Moving now. Oh, wait. I, I see something. There's a egg to my left. And a rusty looking machine gun to my right. They're between me and the next spotlight. If I'm fast, I could check the bag for anything useful. Or maybe get the gun instead. Or I could move to the next position. What should I do? Busted. What? Oh, you mean the gun? Yeah. The rust does seem pretty bad. So, what should I do? Get into position. Right. Okay. Okay. I made it. When you're ready, light up the next spot. seen the last of that thing. Okay. Moving to the next light. Wait. I... I thought I heard something. Oh, God. What if it's... Do you hear that? Come on. Focus. Right. Security head is always saying, eyes open and all that. Wait, I think I see the creature in the shadows. Shit, it really is still here. Wait, it's moving off. I, I think it knows we can see it. I, I don't think my heart can take this. I'm moving up. Before that thing decides to come back. Okay. I'm near a chain gate. Looks like some supplies behind it. Oh, I'm feeling a little exposed here. There's a crate behind me. Maybe I could hide behind it. But it's in the dark. Hold position. Oh, of course. Movement attracts it. Almost forgot. Okay. I'll just stay here until the next light is ready. Way looks clear. For now. God. I hope that thing really is afraid of light. No! Why did you do that? Oh. Oh no! Stay back! Stay back! Ah! you, but I don't think we've seen the last of that thing. Oh shit! I can hear it again. Please, hurry! Okay, moving to the next light. Wait! I... I thought I heard something. Oh god! What if it's... Do you hear that? Come on, focus. 
right. Like the security head is always saying. Eyes open and all that. Wait. I think I see the creature. In the shadows. Shit. It really is still here. Wait. It's moving off. I... I think it knows we can see it. I, I don't think my heart can take this. I'm moving up. Before that thing decides to come back. Okay. I'm near a chain gate. Looks like some supplies behind it. Oh, I'm feeling a little exposed here. There's a creep behind me. Maybe I could hide behind it. But it's in the dark. Hold position. Oh, of course. Movement attracts it. Almost forgot. Okay. I'll just stay here until the next light is ready. No! Why did you do that? of light. When you're ready, light up the next spot. Thanks. Going there now. Oh, oh shit! It's right for me. Yet. What do I do? Hold. <laughs> it, it, it went away. <sighs> I've never been so scared in my life. <sighs> I'm heading to the light now. Okay, I'm really close to the door. Oh! Are you kidding? There's a giant freaking gap here! Oh, damn it! I'm so... So close! The main should light up the staircase. Try that! Hey, a bridge! That's perfect! Finally, I'm at the door. Almost safe. Um, there's three buttons here. Middle one looks broken, but 
One of the other two might open this door. Or maybe turn on all the lights. I don't know which button does what, though. There's no sign or labels. B which button should I push? The left one? Or the right? I, I think... I think I'm gonna push the left. That one. Okay. Pushing it now. Huh? Who is that? You could have told me you had someone in here watching my back. Hi. I made it! Oh, thank you! Thank you! Oh. What was that thing anyway? A mutant? Some kind of messed up ghoul? You're safe now. That's all that matters. Yeah, you're right. Here, I want you to have these caps. Just wish I had more to give. I think it's safe in here, so I'm gonna stay put until someone comes to get me. Thanks again. You saved my life. Hey there. Got back as fast as I could. I heard combat. You all right? Anything to report? Cassandra treated the engineer. He'll be fine. She said we got him out just in time. So how'd things go for you? You okay? Don't worry about me. As head of security, it's my job to worry. Hey, that mess on the floor. Don't tell me that's what's causing all the trouble down here. Looks like, a uh, a feral. But no kind I've ever seen. Wonder how long it was down here. It was a tough fight. No shit. Something like that never goes down easy. Come on, let's report back to Jake.
duty and facility personnel required. Report to the main hall. A light is blinking. Tours Marina. Whenever I feel a little homesick. Yeah. Sorry, a little busy right now. Hey, I'll report in when I'm done. You're back. I've heard from one of the engineers. Contacted me on the intercom. Had quite the tale to tell. Had a monster in it and everything. And Cassandra's already treating the guy Aiden brought back. Good work. I didn't do it alone. I'm just glad to have my engineers back safe and sound. But what about your people? Did you find any of the security team? Yeah. Dead. All of them. And it's my fault. Oh, God. Come on now, Aiden. I'm the one who sent people down first. If anything, this was all my fault. You sent engineers because you thought there were maintenance issues. I sent security because I thought there was a threat. Well, yeah. But what's that got to do with... Security isn't trained to deal with unknown threats. They're guards and watchmen. Not a military task force. Look, sometimes things don't go the way you planned. Then I should have planned better. Um, am I interrupting? What's up? Oh, um, it's just that Teresa's back. She requested a meeting of the department heads, and the chief as well. You know, if you're available. All right, I think we're mostly done here. We'll wrap up and meet you upstairs shortly. Well, guess we should go see what Teresa wants. I'll get everyone caught up on what happened, so join us in the meeting room when you're ready. And as always, thanks for your help. Things would have gone a lot worse without your assistance. Attention. Maintenance required. Report to the elevator. Sorry. A little busy right now. You'll need I'll a shovel for I'm this done. one. Error. Response not recognized. This unit. Hi, how are you? Chief's here. 
So spit it out. What's so important it couldn't wait until the next department meeting? Always the charmer, Aiden. Over the past few days, we've been getting a lot of reports in from settlements and contacts. Sightings of strange things far out in the ocean. After discounting all the usual crap, it turns out what people have been seeing out there are ships sailing up and down the coast. What's the big deal? Uh, you're still thinking like someone from the past. Nowadays, even small fishing boats are rare. But whole ships in the middle of the ocean? That's almost unheard of. So, what's the issue? It takes a well-organized group to maintain and operate something like a ship. Right. Now, I didn't want to jump to no conclusions, so I went to the coast myself. You know, see if I could spot anything with my own eyes. And... I did. It was far away, but... managed to snap a few shots with my camera. Take a look for yourselves. I know it's kind of blurry, but... that symbol on the ship's hull... It looks awful familiar, don't you think? You can't be saying... what I think you're saying. I wish I wasn't, but it sure looks like... It's a gunner ship. They're back. Are you sure? Wouldn't have called this meeting if I wasn't. Uh, but sailing ships up and down the Commonwealth coastline? Why would the gunners do that? They must be looking for something. Yeah, I think you're right. Those gunner ships, they're doing recon. They're scouting the coast. But... why? My god... They're planning an attack from the sea, aren't they? We've been so busy watching the roads and air... We didn't even think they'd keep an eye on the water. Oh, man. If the gunners decide to come at us from the sea... Do I even need to say how bad that would be for us? We need a way to bring the fight to them. I couldn't agree more. Well, if those scout ships had done their job... By now, the gunners will know that, besides the castle, we got diddly squat protecting the coast. Would the castle be enough? I doubt it. At least, not without some serious renovation and upgrades. Huh. Assuming we're right, and these sightings are a prelude to invasion, we could start seeing inbound troop ships very soon. But, if we're fast, we could turn this to our advantage. Hey, Jake. Got any ASAMs laying around? Hold on a minute, I think I see where you're going with this. What's the idea? We use ASAMs to build a new outpost. A military installation, with artillery specifically designed to track and destroy any ships that stray too close to the shore. Hey, that... that's not a bad idea, Aiden. If the gunners are gonna come at us by sea, and they think we're vulnerable, They'd send all their troops at once. They'd be expecting no resistance, and then BAM! We hit their ships with everything we got. Hit them before they hit us. I like it. Wait a minute. Artillery? But that means we'd be killing a lot of people. This isn't like when we assaulted the plaza. The gunners on those ships would know full well what they're getting into. I got no problem with us blowing them out of the water. Not if it means protecting the Commonwealth. It's your call, Chief. But speaking as a former Minuteman, I think building this outpost is our only option. I'm no stranger to these installations. My husband was in the military. Then you get the importance of building this thing. I think we're all in agreement. We build this outpost, protect the Commonwealth from any kind of ship the gunners decide to throw at us. Where do we start? Huh, that's a good point. We'll need to pick a location. Well, don't suppose anyone's got a suggestion. I'm told there's a small landmass just off the coast, Spectacle Island. Settling it has failed in the past, so gunners would expect it to be empty. It would offer the best view of the ocean, and with the right fortifications, could make a formidable stronghold. You might consider the Warwick Homestead. The area's on a peninsula and has a mostly unobstructed view of the ocean. With a few extra walls, it could easily be made defensible. Considering they've already joined us, I'm sure the Warwicks wouldn't mind us building there. 
Hey, what about the castle? I mean, it's got those huge walls. You've already rebuilt its artillery. And it's got a great view of the harbor and ocean. Make a few repairs, toss a few ASAMs in there, and figure out a way to track the gunner ships, and we'd be good to go. Those all sound like good options. What do you think, Chief? Three locations? Yeah, but we'd only have to pick one. And as our leader, it's your call to make. The island. Spectacle Island would be a good choice. And we've already got control of the place. All right. You sure this is where you want to build the outpost? We wouldn't be able to use it as a settlement once we're done. Yeah, I'm sure. Then let's do this. I'll start organizing all the departments, get them ready to start coordinating on this. As for the artillery, we can use the same schematics you found in the castle. A few of those should be more than a match for any ship. And I can begin moving ASAMs and supplies to the building site. But don't worry, we'll wait for your go-ahead before starting construction. Good thinking. The Chief should serve in the area at least once. But I'm not sure I'm comfortable with you being out there by yourself. I'll keep an eye on the kid. I'll need to advise on the construction anyway. Might as well do it in person. All right, then. The Chief, Lupe, and Aiden will head to the site. Everyone else will get everything ready here. Let's get this outpost built, and give those gunners what they've got coming. She seems to be able to handle herself. Why are you worried? Recently there's been murmurings of a rise in raider activity. I'd just rather be safe than sorry, that's all. We'll be much better able to defend ourselves. It's a good position. Yeah, you picked a good spot for sure. I just hope we can get everything built before the gunners make a move. Full confidence in everyone's abilities here. Oh. Attention. Oh. Just... Report. 